Hello, my name is Rampant Mistek and welcome back to Slay the Spire. Today we have a daily to do, daily for January the 22nd, characters the silent, modifiers are heirloom, flight, and deadly events. It's kind of a high scoring run, let's see if we can make it above 1.1, I guess? Ooh, a gold coin. Okay, we have flight so it doesn't matter where we go. What we pick, basically. It doesn't matter. I do have a survivor in the neutral eyes. I want to kill the front one. So yeah, we're golden. Double strike is not enough. So only going to single strike. Hey, he's not attacking. He's making me weak. Oh, this is the turn I get a single strike, really. Is there a point in attacking? Yeah, there is. I'm still gonna remove the slime, even though I'm probably not gonna get back to it. Ghost in a jar is really good. Ooh, accuracy. This could be a shiv run. It's Hexaghost fight. Oh, I really wanna pick up accuracy. I really do. But I don't have any shivs yet. Okay, uh, we do have a chance to get elites in question mark rooms. Oh, that's really bad. I was hoping for something a lot better. There's Blade Dance, there's another accuracy. We do have a blind as well, but we already have a neutralize. I pick these up. I'm setting my bulb on stone. You know what, first recovery moving. I do want lantern. Yeah, I'm picking it up. Should have picked up the accuracy, now I just paid for it. It's still fine. Still more than fine, but... There's the accuracy on the first turn. Survivor here fully defends me. So at this point, we need infinite blades and one more blade dance. Upgraded, of course. A single upgraded accuracy should be more than enough. Here's our AoE. Yeah, definitely picking it up. I might actually go to the fight here. This could be an elite. We need, you know what? We have a ghost in the jar. Remove, upgrade, or transform. Definitely removing. Get the strikes out. Here we're going for an elite, even though I would have preferred to upgrade my accuracy. Alright, so. Metal one is gonna stay the longest, probably, on the field. I do need to double defend here, though. But yeah, that was not good. There's the AoE, and it doesn't matter what it discards. Thing is, though, I, I could lose the perfect here. I probably should. I don't think it's worth using the Ghost in the Jar. The Ghost in the Jar can be far more useful than a single champion. I do not have lethal here. Not on the middle one. So I should focus for one next turn. But I do have a neutralize. Oh, there's an all out attack. So I'm focusing the middle one because I'm hoping to kill it next turn. Yeah, Daisy's gonna go back into the deck, but... It's better than not defending. Yeah, did not kill. <laughs> did not get any attacks. We have three days. Oh, no we don't. Miscalculate it. Alright, so... I'm gonna hit this once with a neutralize, I suppose? Or should I just kill it? No, I just kill it. There's no point in hitting uh, Neutralize on the front sentry, because I'm hoping that it's gonna die soon. Where's my attacks at? Oh, this is not enough to kill. Just two damage short. Bottled Lightning. Oh, there's a Blade Dance. There's a really early Blade Dance. And none of these, because we are gonna run a Shiv deck. 
Cure, I might actually go for the question mark. Okay, it's an elite fight. It's a bad elite fight for us, but... Bad one, because we're running Blade Dance. If we weren't running Blade Dance, it would be a really good fight for us, but... We are, so... At least I got neutralized on this turn. I'm not gonna defend here, I'm not gonna use the Ghost in the Jar. Because I got an Elite here... That's just way too much damage to ignore. Because I got an Elite here, I'm actually going to go to the next rest so I can upgrade. Why are you doing so much damage? I'm vulnerable, so this will not defend me for too much. I could save myself 20 HP, but I would rather save the Ghost in the Jar for now. Okay, this does save me. Oh yeah, he's weakened, right? It's dead. It's gone. Okay, Preserved Insect is really good. We want After Image because we, we're going to play a lot of ship cards, so I'm going to pick it up. I'm not resting here if you're wondering. I'm upgrading the Accuracy and the Blade Dance. First should be Accuracy, then should be Blade Dance. Right? 2, 4... It's better to upgrade the Blade Dance first, but I want the Accuracy upgraded. And we're going to another upgrade. There is a Frozen Egg. When is my next rest? It's actually really far away. But I need to upgrade the Blade Dance. The Neutralize. I'm actually gonna skip question mark rooms because they could spell my doom. Okay, all out attack kills the front one at least. And Blade Dance, I believe, can handle the other one. So what I'm gonna do is hopefully this doesn't hit Blade Dance. It didn't. An attack potion. Okay, there's a finisher. It's a shiv finisher deck now. And we are going to the shop here afterwards. After the match. Okay, which one am I targeting? Probably the front one. I can kill it with two attacks, but I would rather not yet. So that's enough block. So I'm actually gonna just split the damage here. Should be fine for now. Okay, there's an accuracy. Finisher here is pointless. Now I can kill the front one and fully defend. Can I fully defend? No, I can't fully defend actually. Because I would need to play both the defends. It's gonna hit me for 9, yeah. Come on, should be dead. It is. Cloak and Dagger. Definitely. It's a must-have in a shift build. Regal Pillow is nice. There is a trip here. Tell me what is better than an upgraded trip. Now, I don't have an option for a relic. I do want a card to move, but... Trip. Oh, it's just... Re I love that card, honestly. Now, I could risk it all here and go for an elite. Should I risk it? It's probably gonna be Log of Wound, but... There are worse fights than Log of Wound, so I'm actually... I, you know what? I'm gonna just keep it. Just in case. I know I have Preserved Insect, but still. And we're blocking for... 13! I was about to say 12, but... Strike and all out attack. I don't need Terror anymore, I just picked up a trip. Trip is really good. I should pick up Escape Plan. It has no negatives unless you're fighting the time meter. I'm definitely not resting here. Okay, so, the thing I want to upgrade is Finisher, Cloak and Dagger, and Trip. I'm thinking for now I upgrade the Cloak and Dagger because it's going to be the bigger boost in damage. I'm going to need damage against this. Oh, the early accuracy. It's insane. Now I just need a second blade dance and we're done. And we are sorted. There's the trip. I'm gonna be fully defended, so... I mean, hopefully this doesn't hit finisher. 
Maybe it didn't. Air more trip. Okay. I do have a finisher here. But that would mean taking damage, and I don't want to take damage, so. I want to maintain the perfect for as long as I possibly can. Yeah, just all of attack. Oh, it actually discarded the burn. I mean, I was safe because of the after image, but still. All right. The only way I'm going to fully defend here is if I double defend and play the strike, and I'm still not going to be fully defended. Slice is actually not bad. Now this fully defends me. This is six, this is six, yeah. Still haven't used the Ghost in the Jar. That was the whole point, by the way, not using the Ghost in the Jar yet. Save it for a situation where I will not be able to defend myself. And we have Lethal. Fire Potion. And Venom, especially upgraded, does go in a Shiv deck. But we have a lot of things going on. I mean, and Venom isn't bad, don't get me wrong, especially upgraded. I could pick it up. Our deck is really thick though. No, no, I'm not picking it up. Our deck is really thick. I guess I'm taking Lizard Tail. I don't need all the potions. Lizard Tail is just a safe bet. Champion. Oh, okay, good thing I took the Lizard Tail. But again, it doesn't matter where, where we go. I actually got Blade Dance. Can't believe it. So I have a finisher and I have an all-out attack. I want to play all-out attack first, but then I'm risking the finisher actually hitting the all-out attack. I mean, the all-out attack hitting the finisher. You know what? Let's risk it. Okay, good. This is 24 damage, so that's not enough to kill the back one. It is now. I'm not defending, but I did kill one of them, so that's 10 less damage. Yeah, you gotta look at it on the bright side of things. Skill potion, okay. Ooh, if I had taken Venom, I would have taken Riddle with Hose, but... Do I go for an early shop? When's the next shop? Let's see. It's over here, but I would rather go to the rest. There's one here. For now, we're not gonna go to the shop. Heal for 23 or choose one... If I go to choose, I'll have to choose a card. There's no going back, so I'm just gonna heal. Lose skill potion for a relic. Oh, the skill potion, yeah. The trip is not, I'm not losing the trip. Last question mark. Yeah, I knew it was gonna happen. Oh, the good news is we have a finisher. Okay, how much can I hit this thing? Not much. Next hit is not gonna kill it unless I play the finisher on it, but I don't want to. Okay, I'm just gonna survive her. I would still rather keep my HP. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Good thing I got neutralized at the correct turn. Still haven't upgraded the neutralized, which is really bad. We are definitely using the all-out attack. It's 10 damage, so... At least the front one's dead. I'm gonna take this damage, but uh, it's, it's fine. There's the accuracy at the bottom of the deck. He's gonna... Oh, good, he's not attacking. I'm, I'm gonna play the Blade Dance first. It's just, I need to focus him down. This deck does not have a lot of AoE, so... This is gonna aggro both of them. Cannot kill this turn, so I should just defend. Hey, he's hitting for way too much. Good thing I got Cloak and Dagger and Finisher, so... We are golden! 
Yeah, we took a bit of damage there, but Ancient E set is really good. Skill Potion. Cow Chops is a new in this deck. I'm going for the elites here, so do No, I'm gonna risk it for the question mark. It's not elite, at least. Oh, if we had accuracy on this hand. The amount of shivs there to would have been devastating. There's the accuracy I was talking about. So I'm definitely playing this and this. I'm gonna be frail now. There's the trip. I'm still gonna play as many defense as I can. It's so useful. To a certain extent. Are you dead? Or are you not? Yeah, it is. No, 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 no. Technically could pick up a slice. I, I shouldn't, but I could. I shouldn't, but I could. Okay, we need to target that one. I don't have an accuracy up, so yeah, everything goes on him. Then I just triple- do I triple defend? Let's see what I get. Ooh, Crippling Poison. Crippling Cloud, sorry. It's free damage. He's not dead yet, but you will be. I'm still taking damage. Uh, Should have gone a bit more defensive. But I haven't done a ship deck in such a long time that I kind of wanted to. I need to play all attack then finisher. Just don't hit finisher. Okay, good. Kill this one. And we're good! And now I get the accuracy? Um... That was a misclick. That was a big misclick. Nin oh, The ninja scroll. With the blade dance in the opening hand. Now I just need to put accuracy in the opening hand. I'm actually gonna go for this league. We do still have the ghost in a jar, so... And I'm going for a rest afterwards. Then a shop. Oh, it's the book of stabbing. Oh, you, oh the amount of shivs. Oh, the finisher. If I had a finisher in this opening hand, that would have been insane. That's three, six. That's eight cards. If I had a finisher in a trip here... Oh, that would have been glorious. And there's after image. Oh, it doesn't matter which one it discards. It's a, it's a buy three though, so I'm getting hit once, yeah. There's the accuracy. So, yeah, I'm just gonna survive her. Now, let's see, can I kill here? No. If there's something I can't do, that's kill. This is 16 damage, I'm blocking for now. I'm good. I'm fine. Still fine. For now. I need to play... That's gonna be... Yeah, I need to actually play a defend. Okay. You know, I'm gonna have to use the Ghost in the Jar or the Fire Potion here, so... Yeah, Fire Potion it is. Centennial Puzzle? Uh, and none of these. I said I'm going for a double rest, and I am. Um... Yeah, I can smith here and then rest. Actually, I should probably rest and then smith. I don't know why, I just feel like it. Here we want to smith up the trip, so it's an AoE card now. I don't have to target it. There's a toxic egg. There's a backstab. There's Matryoshka. Okay, first of all, I should probably card remove, but I want to pick up Matryoshka and backstab. I'm heading for as many rests as I can get so I can upgrade afterwards. And next floor it's going to be all elite. 
So backstab is really good. I should take it. I can't take Mithrashka now. Yeah. So we are card removing a strike. And that that's it, isn't it? That really is it. The so rest here for an upgrade. Uh, we need finisher. I can actually card remove again if I skip a rest. How useful is a second uh, card upgrade? It is. There is a use for it. Plus, that would mean I could rest in one of these. Just make sure I'm good good to go against the champion. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. So I was thinking after image, but I might actually take neutralize because I need the two thern two thirds of weakness. Those are gonna be useful. Beyond comprehension. Okay, we have a finisher here, so uh, we are about to do a lot of damage. Yeah, it's just gonna blitz one of them, isn't it? Yep. There's that trip. If I had a trip pre the previous turn, they were all gonna mostly die. Saying mostly because I'm not entirely sure. Oh, there's the accuracy. So, I can play two cards here and I should play... No. These two. Okay, it's gone. We have dagger throw. No. We don't need it. I'm definitely resting here. Yeah, I did upgrade my finisher. I was just wondering. I forgot. I know. This is what I was saving the Golden Jar for, in case of this enemy. Uh, why? If I had had, again, Finisher? I mean, I'm always gonna have these in my opening hand, so... If I can get... Accuracy... Trip... Now, I can't get Trip because I have bottled the uh, Lightning already. But I can get Accuracy. And an attack card like Punisher. So I'm playing everything here, right now. That was uh, most of our damage, by the way. Just saying. Why are you doing so much damage to me? That's a lot more manageable. And I might actually have to use the Ghost in a Jar here because there's no way I'm defending against this damage. Okay, we are going to get out of control soon, it's just not as soon as you'd think. We need an extra Blade Dance in this deck. Badly. He's going to make us weak and vulnerable and frail and everything, and all bad things. Eighteen. I cannot block for 18. It blocked for 15. That's as good as it gets. Ah, oh, we just... Well, there goes the perfect. There go my hopes and dreams for a high score. First this. I'm gonna take the 18... Never mind, I'm not gonna take the damage. He's gonna start purging now. Got trip on a bad turn, so to neutralize. Should have just gotten attacks this turn. Ooh, that's a lot of strength. Yeah, at least I got neutralized back. And I'm frail, of course I am. But it's fine, I already lost the perfect so. Just play the safe card. Well, that's that's way too much damage you're trying to do. No, seriously, that's way too much damage you're trying to do. I might actually have to defend here. That's what I'm gonna do. Why do you want me dead? What have I done to you? 
I'm dead. Defending here was not gonna save me. Yeah, Lizard Tail. I, I know I have Lizard Tail. I, I don't anymore, but. What have I done to face the champion? He's probably the worst to face. The one that scares me the most, at least. You know, the game is forcing me to pick up on Envenoma. You know, just saying. Yeah, I'd be happy with a Busted Crown. You don't really need too much energy in a Blade Dance? Oh, don't on Deca. Okay. I'm gonna need to pick up some power. Oh, there's a trip. I'm gonna need to pick up a lot of damage. Or either that or AoE. You know, I should have played the after image like a while ago. Like a long while ago. Like a really long while ago. All out attack. Ah, oh, that would have been funny if it had the burn. No. Question mark. Hmm. Madness would not be bad, actually. Possibly not bad. I need to take setup. Yeah, I'm gonna fight for a relic. I mean, I need to get a lot stronger here, so Vajra is on my to get list. That was so many cards played and not a lot of damage. Mm -hmm. We just need the accuracy out early. As soon as the accuracy rolls out, everything else becomes relatively easy. I was planning on playing the finisher, but I don't know what I decided there afterwards. I don't know why my decision making happened like that. Something has gone terribly wrong. Yeah. Yeah, the build might not last versus Dono and Deca. I need something really powerful. That's way too much damage! Stop dealing that much damage. This is why I hate fighting the two orb walkers. Not only do they constantly attack, then Venoms, they all make sense now. I pick up the reflect. Oh seriously, they all make sense now. So about the Orb Walkers, not only do they constantly attack you, every turn they attack you, every turn they buff with strength, and every turn they add a burn to your deck. Well, not every turn, but almost every turn. It's, it's really annoying to deal with. Upgraded footwork. Definitely something I'm picking up. I want a backflip, but I would rather get an acrobatics. And I'm actually gonna get a sling of courage as well. I ha yeah, I have the money. I don't need to card remove anymore, do I? No, I, I, it doesn't matter anymore. I just need to make, pick up strength. It's gonna help me with the elite fights. Not gonna help me that much against the boss fight. Okay, so. Thing is, though, the. The spiker is going to be sort of difficult to deal with. A bit one down, at least. Yeah, the Envenoms make sense as soon as I got the specimen. I picked up the footwork there because uh, I'm really going to need it. Normally I wouldn't clog up the deck with the footwork. I mean, footwork is just really good. One two card deck. There's a defend. I mean, I can neutralize, and that's about it. This would mean taking damage, and I do not want to take damage. Yeah, this is bad. This is getting out of hand. I'll just remove these. This is getting out of hand. 11! 11! Really?
13! I need to kill it. Okay, Essence of Steel could be useful. Dag I do need AO I do need more AoE against the Donut and Deca fight, but I'm skipping this late. I'm resting here. Next elite, go. It's actually not a bad elite. Plus we we are a bit more powerful versus elite because of the sling of cards, that's why I picked it up. I think this is worth it. Please make the blade dance free. Ah, you know what? Can't complain about that. I need an acrobatics as well. I'm starting to float a lot of energy. On most turns, not on all turns, but on most turns. I play both cards, so. Oh boy. So play the accuracy, then the madness. I cannot kill it here, that's uh, not enough damage, but I can kill most of the other ones. Some of the other ones, I don't want to waste any damage, so. That's still way too much damage he's trying to do to me. I can do 15 extra with the steroid potion. Still not enough. I can mitigate it 9 damage if I kill this. I'm wasting damage like this, but I'm, I'm gonna do it. I think it's better to save 9 extra health. Why have you chosen to attack me this turn? So finisher is free at least. He's gonna play it last. Okay, strike and all out attack because the other cards don't really matter that much. I picked up the deflect the, the exact same reason by the way because I'm sort of starting to panic. Okay, what stone will upgrade? A backstab and an all out attack, okay. We have liquid bronze, that's really nice. Here we are upgrading. Are we? Are we gonna go for another elite? Yeah, probably. Then I can upgrade here and that's about it. Here, here, and we yeah, rest there. Yeah, that's, a, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm actually gonna go for an extra elite, so we are resting here. Bag of marbles, okay. Okay, the game is trying to help me out here. Alright, so first things first, play the after image. Then it's the trip. Madness, madness, made the blade dance free. Am I? Yeah, I'm gonna be fully dependent. No, I'm not. Went short. Just enough to access Centennial Puzzle. That was my plan the whole time. That was my plan the whole time. Here I just cloak and dagger and finish her, don't I? I have the boots, so... Uh, you know what? It's only 10 damage, so I'm actually gonna defend. I'd rather save the HP at this point. Really? Are you planning on giving me my defensive cards when I don't need to defend myself? Come on. Come on now. We know each other better than this. I can... It actually doesn't matter which one of the two I play. Yeah, it took 10. It should be dead. It is. Letter opener, okay. Doppelganger is something I'm not gonna play. So, why I wanted to upgrade? I wanted to upgrade after image. Actually, do I? Maintaining the perfect at this point is. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna just upgrade a couple of defensive cards. I could go to a store, but what am I gonna pick up for 100 gold? Hmm, not that much. Just upgrade a random defend. Could come in useful. And here we might meet another elite, and we do play a lot of ship cards, so this elite is... Oh, and the finisher. I actually want to hit the finisher here. I'm not gonna discard it. So, Blade Dance, then Madness. This is gonna be played last, and it's gonna do a bunch of damage. Backstab 51. Uh, ooh. 
Yep. 15 damage hurt. 15. Yeah, we should be fine on the lethal. Oh, that was a lot of damage. That was because of the time dilation, by the way. We do play a lot of cards. Come on. I was hoping for another leap. What kind of cards do I need? Panache. I could risk it. It was 10 for Panache. Because I'm not gonna heal for too much. At this rest, specifically. I could have gone... No, I couldn't. That's the last rest. Never mind. Now, you know what? I'm not gonna lose HP. I can't risk it. Just please be Panache. Alright! We only get a single card. Oops. Good thing I didn't risk it. <laughs> that would have been horrible. Flying knee? No. I totally forgot that I had the busted crown. Okay, there's one of the artifacting gone. There is another one. Let's madness a hopefully not a defense, so blade dance. And I need to start working on Donu. Don't have an after image. I actually should pop these. I let go of the mouse a bit too early. It happens. Not using this yet. I know it's 5 extra damage, but I want to use it on a turn where I have a lot of shivs and a finisher. Well, that's the only defense I'm gonna get. Probably should have played the finisher there. Started taking damage, that's really bad. So I'm definitely playing a survivor here. He's doing 26, so I'm fine on defense, playing all out attack. That's way too much damage. Really? You know? I. I have no comments on this. It's the game just doesn't want me to win this run. I'm sorry about. It. That's what's happening here. Should have used that steroid potion in the beginning. I'm probably dead this turn. Yeah, if I can't kill. Oh, I'm not dead yet. But next turn I am. <laughs> oh, that's way too much damage. How much can I defend for? Eh, actually, a lot. Come on, I need to kill Donu. This is getting out of hand. Can't kill it this turn. That's, that's a lot of damage. That's way too much damage. I'm dead. I'm never going for a shiv deck again. Until I do, then it's gonna be glorious. Anyway, that was a... Uh, that was not my fault. My expertise and skill... You know, I'm not gonna do this. <clears throat> it's just that... Uh, uh, I was uh, gonna laugh there. I can't do it. I wanted to do it in a serious voice. To blame the game for this fall, but now it was all my fault. Shouldn't have gone for a short run. There were a lot of opportunities to go for a couple of crippling clouds. Catalyst even at one point, I believe. Anyway, regardless, that was my mistake. Maybe slightly RNG's fault. Mostly my mistake. Anyway, my name has been Rampant Mystic. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Slate Aspire. And I do hope to see you all in the next one.